Whoa, this is a weird angle. Okay, let's try again. What's up, YouTube? Mac and Pikachu here. Welcome back to another video. And today, I am going to be showing you guys my secret collection. Actually, it's, it's not a secret, but like the location of it has been a secret. And today, I'm going to be showing you it. So don't come rob me, please. Okay. Anyways, um, the reason that this angle is so weird is because I'm showing you, like, guys, like, this drawer thing, and, like, I don't know how to do that really well, so let's just, let me just flip the camera around, and then you guys can see it. Okay. The collection is actually in two different drawers right here. This is all the Pokemon-related stuff that I have at college. Here is the first drawer. Are you ready? It's my favorite one, if I do say so myself. So this is more of like the um, collection drawer, um, like the individual cards. And then below that, we have the sealed collection for products that I need to open up on the channel. Um, but yeah, you basically open it up. And then over here in these Elite Trainer boxes, I have just like a bunch of like bulk cards. And then over here, I have my beautiful full art collection. Like sometimes in the middle of the night, I just pull open the drawer. And I just flip to a random page. And I'm like, oh my god. Okay, I'm not that weird. But like sometimes I'm like really tempted to do that. So anyways, that's a thing. By the way, guys, look at this. This is a binder, too, so you can, like, pull it out of the drawer if you want to, like, show it off to friends. You know, you got someone that comes over, and you're like, oh, look at this. I got some Pokemon cards, you know? Totally impresses everyone. But anyways, I actually uploaded some of these cards on an app called Snup. There's, like, it's really interesting. Like, you can create communities online, and then... Anyways, I will leave a link in the description if you're interested in downloading it, but you got pictures of Misty, you got pictures of whatever um, on the app, and they're all showing off my full art collection, so give me some love, I just need some friends. Am I cool? Am I cool? Anyways, we're moving on from the removable binder, oh my gosh, innovative technology, we've got this section. This is just like a bunch of just random ultra rare cards, and then we have all of the reverse cards, and then we have like code cards, the random Pokemon fidget spinner thingy that I made, I don't know why I make such strange things, don't judge me. Um, we also got rares, and then like we got more codes over here, and just a bunch of Pokemon epicness. Now on to the second drawer, oh no, it's stuck, hold on, give me a minute. Oh my god, okay, we got it, there we go. Look at this, look at this, oh my gosh. So basically this is just like my sealed collection here. Like for example, this here was a booster box sent to me by Juan. Uh, we have just a bunch of like random loose packs here and there. A lot of them are Japanese. We got the random cereal packs. Uh, we got, oh my gosh, a Shining Legends booster box right here. Uh, we got Dragons Exalted. And then inside of that, we got a bunch of just random English booster packs. We also have collection boxes like these here. And um, I not, right now I'm just gonna quickly show you guys how to actually make shelves on Snup in case you guys are interested in um, actually creating one yourself. Also, if you aren't sure what Snup says, basically it's an app to organize and showcase your collection. Hey guys, so to the right you can see what my profile currently looks like. Now we're going to add some products such as the sealed collection um, to just show you guys how to add products and or add pictures of your cards or whatever collection you might have. Okay, so how this works is you click on the plus sign at the bottom, which is right there. I'll, I'll show you it on screen. Um, and then after that, there's a couple of different options. You can either add an item. So if you want to like show off your specific individual cards, or you can create an entire new shelf, which is like a new collection sort of. So for example, I might have a full art collection or a Pikachu collection or a sealed collection or a weirdos who record videos in the room collection. I, I'm weird. I know. I'm, I'm sorry. Okay, so as you can see right now, I'm making a sealed collection, and I'm going to tap done, and then, ooh la la, we got a sealed collection. It's super simple, super fast, literally all you have to do is lay the item down, take a beautiful picture of it, and if you want, you can add a title, you can call it bananas, you can call it pineapples, you can call it pineapple bananas, or you can call it a Shining Legends box, because that would probably make more sense, and then you click done, and then boom, it gets added to the shelf. Magical. Anyways, going back to the sealed collection, I just want to show you guys some stuff. So this here is a collector's poster box. As you can see, the rouge packs kind of like fell all over the place, but we have that. And as you can see, there's the theme deck right there in that. And then we also, look at this, this thing's cool. We have a Legends of Justice box, and as you can see, there's three booster packs. Boundaries Cross, which is like one of my favorite sets of all time, Black and White, and a Plasma Storm. We have the potential of pulling a freaking Secret Rare Charizard in here. Plus, we get three beautiful Shattered promos. So yeah, look at this. I'm, I'm excited. I'm really excited. But yeah, guys, that was my sealed Pokemon card collection and the card collection that I brought to college. Whoa, I'm so grown up now, I know. Um, but speaking of the Snups app, there is a whole group that you guys should join because I have no friends and I need friends. Please be my friend. Please be my friend. I'm a lonely college kid, but I have weird filler collections, so maybe you can think I'm cool, please. 
But yeah, in all seriousness, I hope you guys will download the app and show off your collections. I'm going to try and be pretty active on there. Um, you guys can also add collections and add your own cards, and I can see them, and you can share them with me. So I encourage you guys to do that so that I can try and interact with some of you guys. But yeah, I think that's going to do it. I will catch you guys in the next one. Bye, guys. First person to ask me what I had for lunch today on Snups gets an internet high five. Okay, bye.